It's showtime! Hey, yo, what up, Fight Worship? We're Boxing Fanatic. I'm back with another one. Earl Spence just confirmed that there will be a rematch. And he also said that once Frank Martin beat Tank, he wouldn't want to rematch Frank Martin. Let's get into it. One, two. One, two, one, two. So, Earl Spence, he confirmed that it's going to be a rematch. It's a rematch clause. And, um... That was the, I guess that was the only way that, I guess, they was going to accept the fight or what have you. I mean, there's more money to be made in that fight. Um, I think Earl Spence probably seen that, you know, um, his fighter, his guy that he promote can beat Tank. And I don't know, we got to wait and see come June 15th. June 15th, you know, they're going to have a chance to settle the score. I know they sparred once. Uh, Frank Martin said that um, Tank tried to put him in the headlock. I guess Tank got mad from Frank Martin using his wrestling moves on him. And it was crazy. It was it was crazy in the gym from, you know, what everybody was basically saying. And um, this is going to be a great fight. That whole fight card is epic. It's big. Um, I can see, you know, it's going to be a lot of, uh, it's Southpaw versus Southpaw. Of course, they're going to be jockeying for position, foot, hand, um, space. Um, it's going to be a lot of skills display showing in that, in that ring, in that square circle. A lot of, uh, ring IQ. Um, I don't know who going to be willing to give up the real estate. I don't know who's going to be on the back pedal. Um, I can see a lot of countering in this fight. I think the fighter that make the most mistakes is going to pay for their mistakes. Um, the fighter that's going to uh, be reluctant to, you know, uh, getting hit. And, man, they're going to have to pay for it. I just see some great fight. I mean, some great things happening in this fight. Um, I know Tank in his last fight uh, against Ryan Garcia, we've seen Ryan Garcia go down twice in that last fight. They always say you as good as your last fight. Frank Martin, last fight, um, he didn't really do too good in that fight. And we have Shakur Stevenson fighting the same guy Frank Martin fought. And a lot of people said that Frank Martin lost that fight. So we know Tank is on a whole different level as far as ring skills iq power speed the ability to get you up out of there we know tank is on a whole different level he cut from a different cloth um it's going to be real good when it come down to it with the both of them um frank martin and javante and i think the guy that put the best foot down come june 15th it's going to be the guy to um, dominate. It's gonna be the guy to dominate. So, um, I don't know, man. I don't know what y'all, how y'all feel about this fight. You know, um, I got mixed emotions because I like both fighters, but you know, somebody got to, somebody got to lose. I don't see it being no draw. Um, can I see some knockdowns in this fight? Of course. Um, we just gotta wait and see. Come June fifteenth. And who's going to be the one to dominate? Who's going to be the one to set the pace? Who's going to be the one to uh, uh, just, you know, stamp their feet and uh, let them know who's the big dog, you know, that night come June 15th? I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think, all right? Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. One love, one life. I'm out. Peace.